Hi all, welcome back. Today I am unboxing my Preeti wet grinder and also sharing few tips to use the wet grinder for the first time. Now how to use your wet grinder for the first time? Keep watching this video. This is a tabletop wet grinder with a 2 litre capacity. It is quite heavy. So to remove it, I am going to disassemble the parts. I am going to remove the screw on top by rotating it nicely and then take out the spinning wheel and then take out the drum. This way I can take out the mixer part easily. Now before using it for the first time I am going to wash the drum and the rotating wheel nicely with soap and water. After washing it, I am going to dry all of the water by wiping it with a clean cloth. Always ensure that the steel drum is completely dried before using in the grinder. I am also drying the spinning wheel. Now I am going to attach the drum into the mixer body and ensure there is a click in sound. Now I am going to put back the spinning wheel and secure it tightly with the spring. Now this is tightly secured. For the first use I am going to run the grinder with one cup of oil. This grinder is made of stone so minute stone particles and dust would be accumulated to remove this nicely and to ensure smooth running of the wet grinder. I am going to add 1 cup of sunflower oil and run the grinder. I am going to run it for 20 minutes. So this will ensure that all of the dust and all of the minute particles are thoroughly cleaned as well as the grinder is nicely smoothened and polished. I have added 1 cup of sunflower on the hole. sunflower oil now the mixer grinder has been running for 20 minutes and you can see the oil has become so dirty now I'm going to turn it off and remove this oil and discard this oil it is always safe to follow this procedure before using your wet grinder this will ensure the smooth running of your wet grinder. Now you can see the dirt accumulated here. Discard this and now I am going to wash the drum nicely with running water and soap. I am going to wash the spinning wheel also. And again, I am going to dry it completely with the cotton cloth. Once the wheel is nicely dried and the drum is nicely dried, you can go ahead and use it. So I hope this video was helpful to you. If you do give this video a thumbs up, please consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you for watching. Bye guys.